In the rugged wilderness of Mount Erymanthus, where the ancient trees loomed tall and the air was thick with the scent of pine, there dwelled a beast of unmatched ferocity, the Erymanthian boar. Its massive tusks glistened with malice and its eyes burned with an untamed rage that struck fear into the hearts of all who dared to tread near its domain. Word of the boar's reign of terror spread like wildfire, sending shivers down the spines of villagers and warriors alike. But amidst the whispers of dread, there arose a hero of unparalleled strength and valor, Hercules, son of Zeus and champion of mortals. With a resolve as unyielding as the mountains themselves, Hercules set forth on his quest to rid the land of this fearsome menace. Clad in the skin that marked him as a son of the gods, and armed with naught but his bare hands and indomitable will, he ventured into the heart of the wilderness, his muscles tensed with anticipation. The journey to find the Erymanthian boar was fraught with peril at every turn. Hercules battled through dense forests, where the gnarled branches reached out like skeletal fingers to ensnare him, and treacherous ravines where the echoing cries of unseen beasts sent shivers down his spine. Yet, with each step, he pressed on, his determination unshaken by the challenges that lay ahead. As the days turned into weeks, Hercules' quest led him deeper into the heart of the untamed wilderness. Along the way, he encountered trials that tested his strength and courage to their very limits. From deadly traps set by the boar's cunning, to fierce predators intent on claiming him as their next meal. Yet, with every obstacle overcome, Hercules grew ever more resolute in his mission. Finally, after what felt like an eternity of relentless pursuit, Hercules came face to face with his quarry. The Erymanthian boar stood before him, its massive form casting a shadow over the land as its eyes blazed with an unbridled fury that matched his own. With a final roar that echoed through the mountains, Hercules charged into battle, his muscles rippling with power as he closed the distance between them. The clash of titans shook the very earth beneath their feet as they grappled with one another, each seeking to gain the other hand in their deadly dance of strength and skill. For hours they fought, in a deadly embrace as the sun passed across the sky above them. Blow after blow rained down upon them, each one fueled by a primal fury that burned deep within their souls. Yet, despite the boar's savage strength and ferocity, Hercules refused to yield, drawing upon his inner reserves of strength and courage to continue the fight. At long last, with the sun sinking low on the horizon and exhaustion threatening to overcome him, Hercules seized his moment. With a final surge of power that seemed to shake the very foundations of the earth, he wrestled the boar to the ground, his victory ringing out across the land like a thunderous clap of triumph. As Hercules stood triumphant amidst the wreckage of his battle, a sense of peace washed over him, knowing that he had succeeded where others had failed. Yet even as he savored the sweet taste of victory, he knew that his journey was far from over. For beyond the horizon lay countless trials and tribulations, each more perilous than the last. But with courage as his companion and strength as his guide, Hercules would face them all. For he was more than a mere mortal. He was a legend in the making.